The biggest challenge with the knowledge management system is getting into a routine of creating the notes. I quickly noticed that my workflow became slightly too heavy. When I finally sat down to process my notes, I was slowed down by the sheer amount of collected material and content in my backlog. Where should I start with processing my notes? The podcast I listen to during the commute to work or the YouTube video I watch during my break. Oh, by the way, I finished a book with 10,000 words of highlights yesterday. In this video, I'll share a method I learned to streamline the knowledge management workflow uh, to make it a little simpler and to focus on what is important and what's creating value to your system. Let's jump right in. Readwise is a powerful tool to sync all your highlights directly to your PKM tool of choice. It currently supports integrations into tools like Obsidian, Notion, Logseek, and some others. This means that as you're reading a, an ebook or highlight passages, these passages are being synced into Obsidian in real time. This is particularly useful when you want to keep the process lean. I'm not sponsored by Readwise, but I genuinely think it's one of the best tools for knowledge workers. If you want to give Readwise a go, there's a link in the description to get one free month. And in return, you're giving me also one free month of Readwise use. Let's say you've read a few chapters and highlighted some key points. The next time you start a PKM session, you can find your highlights and begin creating literature notes out of these. I go through the imported highlights and then re-highlight the passages that resonate with my thinking the most. These are highlights that inspire me the most. If you have fleeting notes or ideas that pop into your mind throughout the day, uh, you can write these down into your favorite notepad and then just return to them at the end of the day for processing. I notice that while I'm reading, I'm already thinking of kind of connections to the notes I have in my system. After a while, it starts happening automatically. So leverage the freshness of reading the idea and process the notes as soon as possible. If you've highlighted it in the book, it must inspire you in some way. So leverage the momentum of inspiration to your advantage. I open up a new document and add the relevant information of the book. You can use templates in Obsidian and Logseq to quickly add the metadata and copy the information from the imported file. This can be added later. I then start writing up the ideas in my own words. The ideas are now being transmuted through the lens of your own experiences. Add a title to each idea archetype to separate the different concepts presented. This is definitely not an exact science. Once I have a few literature notes, I can start exploring the notes in my system. I create an idea playground under each idea archetype and then link to my notes in my system. Add a few notes on why you added the specific note and how it connects to the new idea. Then you can create, start creating permanent notes. You think how this is changing what you previously believed. The more connections you make to the notes in your system, the better. This is a high effort part of the process, but worth doing well as you are really morphing the way you're thinking. We live in an age of abundant information. We get into the mode of consuming content, listen to podcasts, read books. This is all a huge amount of information that we want to turn into knowledge. But this information quickly piles up into a mountain uh, that is hard to then climb and you end up giving up. Like anything in a good productive system, breaking down these processes into manageable chunks will make it more likely that you will continue with that routine. So balance out the amount of information you're consuming with the amount of notes you're creating. When you go through the whole workflow in one sitting, it's much more satisfying as you're creating notes into your system in every session. Keeping a good balance of information being consumed to information being processed into knowledge or notes will accelerate your learning tenfold. Hope you found this video useful. If you did, click like and consider subscribing for more information like this in the future. Keep PKMing and see you in the next video. Bye.